What's up everybody? So today we are gonna learn the basic squat. One of the best exercises for strength for soccer players. All right, let's get started. So, first things first. Why should soccer players squat? Well, the main reason is this. Leg strength and maximum leg strength is one of the most important things for your ability to run fast, jump high, accelerate and decelerate in a game. And the squat is maybe the best exercise to strengthen the muscles of your legs, get them nice and strong. So this is how we're gonna start. I want you to stand in a position like you would if you were gonna try to jump as high as you can. So I'm in a position just like that. You might take one little steps a little wider, but you don't have to. That is a personal preference. I personally like to have my toes facing slightly out, not straight in front of me and definitely not pointing inwards. And this is what we're gonna do. To start out, we're gonna put our arms out in front of us like this. We're gonna take a deep breath and we're simply going to squat down in between our legs. So it should look like this. And then we pop back up. Now, a few things I want to mention here. We want to keep our heels and our toes on the ground. I like to think of three points of contact my big toe, my little toe, and my heel. I want to keep all three of those on the ground and push through them. So it should look like this. One time from the side. And as far as how deep you should go, ideally you should get your hips down slightly below your knee. But since we're soccer players, not power lifters, that is not 100% necessary. Now, let's take this and make it just a little bit harder. This isn't adding any weight yet, but it is increasing your mobility. So what we're gonna do now, hands above our head. And it's gonna be the same thing. And we're gonna to try to keep our hands and our back as upright as possible while we, do, while we do this. All right, and go. And one more. One from the side. And I probably didn't stay perfectly upright, but as you can see, I'm genuinely trying to keep myself as upright as possible. Now, that is very beginner stuff. So, those of you that are a little more advanced, we're gonna add a little bit of weight to that. So, what I have right here is a 20 pound medicine ball. Now, you could get a heavier one. You could also do this with a dumbbell. You could even do this with a bag or a milk jug or something like that to add weight. Use what you have available. The exercise we're gonna do now is called a goblet squat. So for the goblet squat, what we're gonna do, we're gonna take our medicine ball or our dumbbell, and we're gonna hold it on our palms, up underneath our chin, on our chest, just like so. And we are going to make sure we don't let our torsos fall forward. And we're gonna perform the squat just like we were without the weight. So it should look like this. One more. Now let's do a few from the side. All right, so that is how you do a squat for soccer players. Now, if the weight gets too light, that is when we are probably gonna introduce a barbell and start doing some form of back squats. But for now, I want you to give that a try. Try to do three to five sets of three to five repetitions with perfect form, making sure every rep is relatively fast. 
And once you're good at that, try to add as much weight as you can into the goblet squat. Until that gets too hard, then come back for the next video when I teach you how to do a proper back squat. All right, guys, I'll see you next time. Peace.